Hey guys, it's Issa, and today we're opening a BoxyCharms March box. Let's get right into it. All right, guys, I got my scissors, and I'm super excited to get into this thing. This is my first ever BoxyCharm box. It is supposed to be the March box, but it is April 2nd, so it did come a little late, but I also ordered it in late March, so are we surprised? No. Ooh, it's so cute. It says, hello, Charmer. BoxyCharm. Ooh, look at it. I'm so excited. Boxy charm. Oh, it tells me what it's on there. I don't want to look at that. Oh, okay. First up, we have an almond honey hair mask. I definitely don't want to keep getting hair stuff because that is not my priority here. I purely want makeup. No skincare, no hair stuff. But I will, of course, try this out. It's an almond honey intense repair yogurt hair mask with prebiotics, canola, and some super botanicals for beautiful hair, sulfate, and paraben free. I will try this. I don't know if it works for every kind of hair because it doesn't ask you what kind of hair you have on those little forms. It says damaged, fragile, and brittle hair. My hair is very thick. So I feel like I would use this up in a second. Next up, we have a signature brow precision brow pencil. <sighs> I was so scared that I'd get a brow product because I'm so scared it won't match my brow. Because the only options were like light blonde, light brown, and dark brown. And I put, of course, dark brown, but they're nearly black. But I'm not black. If I use a black pencil, it just looks too dark. Let's see, it's from Kat Von D. I'm pretty sure that Kat Von D is not the person of the company anymore. So here's a product Kat Von D Signature Brow Pencil, Precision Brow Pencil. My favorite brow products are the Benefit ones, the Benefit Brows. And I have a mini Precisely Brow Pencil, but I do not have the full. So the shade is Pop, Taupe, or whatever, which is a little light for me, I think. Let's look. Oh. That is not my shade at all. Look at that. It's like a grayish brown. That's not my color, but that's okay. Well, nonetheless, it's cute. It's really sleek packaging. Okay, so I got a little freebie gift thing for signing up in March or whatever. So you got to pick something and I chose this. It is a cute little palette. Oh, the packaging is so cute. It's an Ace Beauty Scarlet Dusk. I think that's like the palette name. Let's open it up. I'm struggling. This packaging is just adorable and it's super small and compact. This thing just came out. Oh, but I just really wanted this palette when I saw it and I was like, oh, it's so beautiful. I'm gonna swatch crimson. Let's see. Whew, that's so pretty. I didn't do a good swatch, but the color is so pretty. I'm gonna swatch hibiscus. <gasps> that is so pretty. Oh my God, I love that. I'm terrible at swatches, but that is so pretty. <gasps> We've got Sunset Rosé, or no, I don't know why I said Rosé. Sunset Rose, Crimson Shade, Nocturnal, Aruba, Hibiscus, Lotus, Bahamas, Maui, Pink Moon, and Aurora and Sangria. And this packaging is so adorable. I really like this palette already. I can't wait to try it out. All right, I'm going to take this thing out and see what else there is, because there should be a couple more things. What is this? A mini ceramic, uh, a mini ceramic cooling iron. Cur I can't talk curling iron with cool tips. This is so cute. I feel like I've been wanting to curl my hair and I just have it. I'm not gonna read all this, but it's so cute. And it comes in a little bag. This is so great to like take with me, whether I go on trips or go from one house to the other. Let's open it up. It's mini and it's compact and it's adorable. And it's a cute little lilac purple shade. I'm excited to try it. I think I should have one more thing. Oh, I have two more things. What's this? I don't even know what this is. Are these tweezers? Oh, they're like fancy tweezers. This is from Chella. The curling iron was from Sutra Setra. If I can get it open. Oh, there's a little tape right there. I'm slow. Okay, so they're tweezers. I don't know, is this for like grip, maximum grip or something? It might take a little while to get used to. That's cute. Is this a palette? Is this a BoxyCharm palette? It says, hello, Charmer. Oh, it, it's definitely a palette from BoxyCharm. Hello, Charmer. Oh, that packaging is so slick and cute. Let's open it up. Those shimmers. I don't have shimmers that color. I did not expect to get two palettes. Oh yeah, I got six products because this this was a freebie, so that was a s extra six product. You usually get five full-size products in these things. That Charmer, look at this. Let's try this. Oh! Let's do unboxing because this is an unboxing. 
Oh, that's pretty. Okay, I'm gonna do two more, one more, three more, five more. This is full size. I get it. Oh my gosh, it's based on box, boxy term. I'm so dumb. That was a terrible swatch. That was my bad. I'm gonna redo that. Okay, so the swatch doesn't come out great, but it's a pretty color. We have a white boxy charmer, full size, exclusive, spoiler, luxe, unboxing, sneak peek, premium, swipe up, pop up, and cup of joe. Cup of joe. Oh, swipe up looks so pretty too. It's like such a smooth sparkle. Dang, those are nice glitters. Okay, let's do one more. Do I have a clean finger? My thumb. These are so soft. Okay, I guess we're doing it on the other side. Lux, that's really pretty. My hands are a mess. I'm gonna go clean up real quick. My hands are covered in glitter. So is my arm, but it's okay. So yeah, this is a really cute palette. I'm so excited I got two palettes in this. Eyeshadow is definitely like my favorite makeup product. So that's exciting. I'm gonna refer back to that card we got in the beginning and see the prices. Okay, so this curling iron, Retails for $50, Ooh, that's a deal. That on its own is double the cost of the box, which is $25 a month, or a deal if you get it annually. Then we have the Vegan Beauty from KVD in top for $21. We have the BoxyCharm Hello Charmer palette, which retails for $39. Project Beauty Hair Girt Intense Repair Hair Mask for $10. So I think that's the cheapest thing we have in the box. And then we have, the tweezers, the cello tweezers for $20 for a pair of tweezers. I, these better be good tweezers. And the price isn't on there, but this I believe is $35. I'm gonna come back to you with that total price. So this whole box of stuff was $25 for the month for the box of charm box. And the value of everything in it was $140. That is almost six times the value of the box itself. And that isn't including the Ace Beauty Scarlet Dusk palette. That would make the value go up to about $170, $180. So that's not even including this. I'm pretty happy with today's haul and I didn't even expect to get some of these products because they weren't what I put in the little box. Like these, these three things weren't even like stuff I really wanted, but now I'm excited to try them. I don't think this is my shade, so I might re-gift this to someone else, but I am excited to try this hair mask and this has to be a good tweezer if it's 20 bucks. So I'm excited to try this stuff. Also, if I minus the products I wasn't even as excited about, which I'm still excited for, just like not as as like the palettes or the hair curler, but if I subtract all that from the value, you. The value is still 90 bucks. I paid $25 for this box. So I'm super happy with how this box turned out. Thank you guys so much for watching my March Boxy Charm unboxing, even though it's like two weeks into April. I got it on April 2nd and I'll probably post it not this Friday, but the next Friday. I hope you guys enjoyed nonetheless if it was late. If you liked this video, I'd appreciate it if you gave it a like and subscribe to my channel. Comment down below what other videos you'd like to see from me. I hope you guys have a great day, a great week, a great month, a great 2020. Adios!